Good afternoon, my name is Pop. This is a video tutorial in Ubuntu Basics and I'm going to be showing a little bit about how you can crop pictures when you are making an EPUB and adding those pictures to the EPUB. Of course you will be using a word processor file in order to create your EPUB and the way you do this is to import the picture into the word processor file. Now you might think since the word processor LibreOffice Writer has got a method whereby you can crop pictures that you can just do it there but for some reason it doesn't work so I'm going to show you a workaround until they fix that I've got a picture over there on the left that I downloaded a picture of Ben Affleck and I'm going to import that picture into the word processor file by going up here and I'm going to say insert picture from file and it's a picture of Ben Affleck and I'm gonna say OK now here he is. Let me make it full screen. This picture is in the ODT file, the word processor file. And I am going to convert this ODT file after I save it into an EPUB and then that picture will be in there. But say for instance that I wanted to crop that picture. There is a temptation to want to use the cropping tool that's inside of LibreOffice Writer and you go to picture and I recommend you always go to picture because all this other stuff right here that's in picture and let me show you when you open it up you see all that other stuff's across there anyway there is a cropping tool and I'm going to crop the left see how it works and now I'm going to crop the right and now I've got a narrower picture and I'll say OK and that's what it looks like and that, let's say that's what I wanted to put into my uh, EPUB. Well for some reason all of this does not carry over when you use Calibre or in case you don't like Calibre in case you want to use Writer to EPUB the one click changeover. To verify for you that this does not work I am now going to save this file and I'll call the file uh, let's see, we'll call it uh, uh, on screen. I'll call it T for test. And there I've saved it. It's a word processor ODT file. I'm going to diminish it and it should be right there. If I open it up, it'll just open up the same way. Now I'm going to go to Caliber and I'm going to import the T file and I'm going to add and I'm going to go to desktop T open now I've done really nothing to this yet I have just added the ODT file to Calibre for future conversion and I haven't converted anything yet it takes a minute to add the file to Calibre and whoa it's graying out because I've got my recording program going when I convert it's going to convert it to an EPUB. I've told this program caliber all of my parameters that I always like. And when I say OK, it opens up and converts it. You can see it working. And here where it says ODT, it's later going to say EPUB. And it just takes a second. And when it does, I'll be able to tap on EPUB. And then the reader that is built into Calibre will open up this file and look it it's not cropped now that really bothers me if I don't think that it is caliber and I think it is just the reader you can do the following click here when I click here look over to the left and watch some for some wiggling there you saw you saw that wiggle over there here I go over to the TE pub and instead of just tapping it and opening it up with the viewer I just used, I'm going to right click and I'm going to use a different viewer. I'm going to open, I'm going to open it up with eBook Reader, which is the same thing as FB Reader. For some reason they were not consistent in their naming. It's a Russian program and it is actually the best eBook reader you can use on an Android phone. Well, it's loading the book. Let's see what it looks like. See? No crop. What the heck is going on? Well, I'll show you workaround. 
and that's the whole purpose of this entire uh, video and I'm going to show you how you can crop these things. You have to use an external program you use shot well. Go to your AFLEC picture and right click it and open with shot well. And shot well has a very good cropping tool. It's control O and I'm just going to make it the way I want and you want to make sure that you save it to a different name otherwise it will overwrite your existing file and let's do that uh, crop and let's go file save as and I'm going to say current format hmm okay I'll hit okay and then where on the desktop and I'll just call this Affleck 2 or Affleck cropped enter close it and now here's Affleck cropped now I want now to open up my T file ODT and I'm going to erase this one and I'm going to insert picture from file and I'm going to get the cropped one open and there it is now this picture will save correctly in the cropped version while I'm up here although we're just talking about cropping I'm going to go a little bit more and show you how you can arrange these pictures you go over to type and you make sure it's on paragraph if you want the picture bigger or smaller make sure you do keep ratio let's go three inches now it's much bigger and let's also bring it not from the, to the center but to the left and it's going to go over there there's one other thing you got to do and you must not forget to do this you must go to compress graphic and change this 1.48 to 3 and you hit calculate and you hit OK and now you're done and now it will work my name is Pop and I'm going to show you in the next video how you can arrange the pictures to go on the left on the right in the center with text preceding with text following and the limitations of having text on both sides of the picture and the limitations of having a transparent picture with text going through the picture there are some readers that work well with this there are some readers that it doesn't work well with at all my name is pop and I thank you very much